Hi guys, welcome back to the Planner Pixie Co. Show and welcome to our very last new releases of 2023. Can you even believe that we're here? I cannot, but also I can. This year has just flown by. Um, I have two exclusive kits for you guys this week. Two collabs with two different foil shops, so it's a very exciting time. So I also do have a couple of foil collections myself that have absolutely nothing to do with these kits, but um, it's Valentine's and I felt like I needed to wrap up the majority of Valentine's this week, so we're going to do that. Um, everything will go live this Friday the 15th at noon Eastern Standard Time. Kits are going to be 10% off because they're both exclusive. Um, foil will be 25% off. So. Um, let's go ahead and get into it. So the first one that I have is called Working on My Fitness. I feel like this is a big New Year's resolution for most people, as is it's going to be me too. Um, so I do have a foil collab with Kristen's Planner. Um, both of my collabs, I actually do not have the foil in hand and I do not even have graphics for it, you guys. So I have been waiting to film this video, which is why it's a day late and I still don't have them. Um, so, you know, everybody's in still in the middle of Black Friday orders and it's just kind of that year end push, that year end stressful time. So, um... I'm sure the ladies will have them to me tomorrow. So once that happens, um, I will post in the Facebook group and on Instagram. So just be on the lookout. I can't wait to see what they both have come up with. But um, this is my very first collab with Kristen's Planner. And I'm very, very excited to see um, what she does. And I'm very excited to be collabing with her on this one. So um, I really love this kit. And I really love these colors. Take a gander at all the boxes. And like I said, this is exclusive art so you will only find this one here at planner pixie co look i love how pretty the blue is um i do have the ultimate kit here you can get it in both the ultimate and the full kit ultimate kit is 10 pages full kit is eight pages here is all of your this is pretty much the two extra pages all the rounded boxes, all the labels. Purchase the Deluxe or or Ultimate. I always say Deluxe, Ultimate. The bigger kit, the 10 page kit, you guys. Purchase the 10 or the 8 page um, kit in full. And I'm going to throw in the double box this weekend. It's a weekend freebie, so you've got an extra little gem scene there. You've got the labels. You've got the um, checklist. You've got the patterns. We do have a tall box. Um, add-on option for this one too so not only are you working out but you're eating healthy right we're all gonna do that in the new year I'm gonna try my best um, here is the options we have our same five options that we usually have cute and then let's get into the washi I really don't know what to tell you guys as far as foil goes I don't really know what all colors Kristen has in her shop. She, I did look and she does have quite a selection though. So I feel like any of like the silver hollows and the silvers, um, sparkly hollow perhaps. I could look up on my phone real quick, I guess. Um, I'm pretty sure that she's a physical shop only and that she does not have printables. Go ahead and show you the washi options while we're here. I did do a solid and a pattern here. So I do have this green color. It's kind of like a green gray. Um, I really don't know what to say about these two. Uh, you know, I should come up with names before I get on camera. We're going to go. I've got two different like coral options here. I guess we're going to go with like coral for this one and we'll go peach on this one. And then I did an extra pattern, if you don't like the pattern that I chose. That is your washi options. Okay, I do have this pulled up here. So, she has unfoiled gold, silver, rose gold, hollow, gold pixie dust, silver pixie dust, shattered glass, antique, Gunmetal. Ooh, gunmetal might be fun with that. Red melon, coral, light rose, matte fuchsia, bright pink, copper, bronze, pumpkin, terracotta, kiwi, grass green, green, winter green, hunter, olive, almond, 
Almond, I do believe, is matte bronze. So she does have a matte bronze. Teal, Seafoam, Lagoon, Powder Blue. The Powder Blue could would be fun. Royal Blue. Icy Blue. Well, she's got Ice Blue, which I feel like is my Icy Blue. So that would be the same. Lavender Violet, Red Violet, Deep Purple. Blue Hollow, Pink Hollow, Purple Hollow. Red Glitter, Pink Glitter, Blue Glitter, Orange Glitter, Green Glitter. Shiny Black and... Uh, she's got a foil of the month, which is Silver Stars, and I do believe that would go with this one, too. So any of, like, your blues, um, your um, silver tones are going to go. And like I said, she has an almond, which I do think is um, matte bronze, which would go really good with this one. So be on the lookout for the graphics for the foil. I will have them shortly, you guys. Okay, this next one, I just... Ugh, I've never seen anybody do a kit in this theme, so I'm really, really excited about it. Um, this is my next collab with Alicia Craft. And again, once I get the graphics for that, I will share with you guys. But oh my goodness. This one is called Lady. It is, of course, Lady and the Tramp inspired. And I went into this thinking that this would be a good alternative for Valentine's Day, I feel like, if you didn't want to do the traditional Valentine's Day. And especially if you're doing like an all Disney year or something, or maybe an all Disney month. I think this would be really cute for Valentine's Day or just an anytime kit. But look at all these boxes! Once again, my artist just knocked it out of the park. I love the colors. Look at the detail in the house. Is that not gorgeous? It's so good. You know what? Originally, um, I let my artist pick the colors on this one because I was just like, I don't really know. Just whatever's like the most dominant pick. And she actually did green. She gave me a green pattern, which was actually this pattern right here. Well, if I could get to it was this pattern but and I thought okay yeah that was like a lot of grass but honestly it still wasn't enough that I thought green should be the color so I actually pulled this color I felt like it went a little bit better and I changed the color of that pattern so I think that goes way better I really like that combination I don't really know what do we call it though it's kind of like a brown maroonish I don't know. What would you call that color, you guys? Because I have a, I have a washi that's in that color. So, purchased the Ultimate or full, full kit, and I'm going to throw in the double box scene. Look how cute. This is the scene at the end. But I do have another option for you guys. Uh, this actually was not the full scene that got drawn for me. Um, this is. But it had a Christmas tree in it. And I thought that's very, you know, very Christmassy. Um, you could use it for a Christmas kit if you wanted to, especially if you're as behind as I am and you've got to catch up two or three months. You definitely would get it in time to use it for Christmas if you wanted to, but I just wanted to do this as a, another different double box option if you wanted to use it for that. Um, or it could be an anytime kit, and that's just that's just what the scene was at the end. So I didn't want to leave Jock out. I That's his name, right? I think. Trusty and Jock. Um, right? I just watched it not too long ago, but I actually... You know, it's been a really long time since I watched Lady and the Tramp. Like, probably, like, the actual older cartoon. Probably when I was a kid. And it just occurred to me that they say Jim Deere and Darlin because that's what the dogs hear them call each other and that's why that's their names that's really cute but anyway yes I wanted to give you that option if you wanted this you're gonna get this for free but if you want to grab that to use it in that way so you get the full effect there there you go we've got the labels we've got the checklist we've got the patterns uh, your washi options I did a blue what are we gonna call this color it's kind of plum Let's say plum, although it's it's like a brown plum, but we're going to go plum, yellow, and then I've got this pattern in the pink. Um, foil colors, should we pull up Alicia's side? I feel like we've done Alicia's a few different times, so I don't, I feel like any of the silvers again, pinky tones would be nice, any kind of blue tones would be nice with it. I don't want to hold up exact foil colors because I just don't know. Let's see. 
All right, this is what she had a black gold, gold, gold hollow, champagne lights, silver, matte silver, silver pixie dust. I think any of those silvers. Uh, rose gold, copper, hollow, sparkly hollow. Those two would go good. Rainbow ballerina, I think, would be good. Light pink would be good. Just pink, but it looks like more of a darker, like, wine-looking color. There's a hot pink. There's a pink hollow, which pink hollow would probably go good. Coral matte bronze. I think matte bronze would, would work. Light brown, bronze, red, red glitter, merlot, and pumpkin. And then... There's also orange, orange glitter, ice blue, light blue. I think both of those would work. Blue hollow would work. Blue, blue glitter. Mm, those are a little dark. Navy blue, teal, winter green, light green, green hollow green, grass green, olive green, lavender, lavender hollow, violet, purple, black glitter, patriot. So I think, like I said before, any of the pinks, the blues, the silvers would go really good. So that is lady and i'm so excited okay i do have two foil collections over here and like i said they have nothing to do with either of these kits because i let the other ladies do that for them but let's get into it anyway so honestly you could use both of these kits if you were using the lady kit for valentine's day because i think alicia's going more on the route of just like an any time and not necessarily valentine's i don't know she took a poll on her instagram and i think that was majority um, but I've got two different Valentines and, you know, if you wanted to mix and match some in there, if you wanted to go straight up Valentines, you could use it with a lady kit. So, this is the 044 Pixie Pack. So, this was, um, my original all heart bundle that was in the shop. And the heart bundle that I did, was it last week? I said was going to replace this one. But I was looking through my spreads and I was looking at my Valentine spread from this year. And I was like, you know what? That's a really good foil bundle. Like, let's not get rid of that. So I'm bringing it back anyway. I'm not going to completely replace it. So it's just another all heart bundle. But it's got a totally different vibe. I feel like the heart bundle from last week was more like a whimsical looking hearts. This is just like your basic heart. And I did do this one in the new red ice. So it's a very blingy. Um, and then here's your new back page. So you have your, uh, your double box and your tall box combined on this page. And you get two extra boxes and all of your flags. I do have an underlay to match this if you wanted to be super matchy matchy. I'm just going to show it to you. I don't even have it. I could not be bothered to foil this you guys but this is what it looks like. It's not been foiled yet but it is those same hearts so if you wanted to pick up these underlays to go with this totally can do that. All right the next one is completely new. This was not in the shop. You guys wanted me to bring like a super valentine one and not so much just like hearts and love. You wanted a valentine one so this is what I came up with and I'm obsessed. I think this looks so stinking cute. I did this one in pink hollow. So I did the boxes a little bit differently than what I normally do my uh, foil bundles in, but I love the way it turned out. I felt like if I shrunk these down, like you couldn't, I did that at first. And then when I printed it out, it just did not look right. I felt like you kind of lost what they actually were. So I went in a different direction but you've got all of these heart overlays and then you've got like your valentines your um your glasses clinking you've got like the key the key to my heart you've got your cupid's bow and then over here i just did some hearts and then i did xoxo and then this sheet is completely different um other than you do have more hearts but it's on the other side so this is probably my favorite part of this the lips blow and the kiss i think that's so adorable so you've got a little bird holding a heart you've got like an engagement ring or a wedding ring you've got a balloon heart and then i've got b mine down here you've got your regular confetti underlays and then here is your bottom washi so you've got your hearts all the way across you've got xoxo and then i just put love 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 and then we do have your back page here you've got your tall box that actually says valentine i did the uh, blow and a kiss on the double box you've got your flags with those hearts and then i took the heart pattern from the headers and did one of the boxes where it's kind of in the background and then again if you want to bring in this pattern and underlays I got you covered. I've got just underlays in that heart pattern. So 
that is what I have for you this week, you guys. So just a reminder, this is the last new release of the year. Um, I'm taking a couple weeks off from new releases and <laughs> not working because I'm so busy still with Black Friday orders. Um, we will be back on January 1st with all of our monthly exclusives, which is all of our new freebies, our new font of the month. We'll have two pre-foiled kits. We will be back on January 5th with actual new releases, which I already do have another custom kit for you guys. And I do think I plan on doing a seasonal pre-foiled mystery next year. So I do think that will be coming out in January too. Although I have not set the date yet but i think by january 1st when i post the video for all the exclusives that i should know that day when it'll be coming out and i also want to remind you um when this posts tomorrow you'll have thursday and friday left of pr applications and uh they will be took down at midnight est friday night and then everybody will be emailed monday so if you haven't applied for the pr team yet please do so. I'm excited. I'm a little overwhelmed by the amount that we already have, but um, I will be able to get through them over the weekend and then we'll be able to announce everybody in January. I'm very nervous, but I'm very excited. And thank you guys to everybody who has already um, applied, I sort of say supplied, already applied. I just appreciate you guys so stinking much and I just want to say thank you for an incredible 2023. I cannot wait to see what 2024 holds for Planner Pixie Co. And um, you guys let me know what you're most excited about for this week's releases, what you plan on picking up. Hope to see you in the shop on Friday and I will talk to you next time. Bye guys!